And so it was that I awoke on this morning in question, fresh from dreams of maniacal magistrates and amphibious policemen and ten quid lighter in pocket. What are you doing, Jeeves? Attempting a little verisimilitude, sir. Huh? Oh, what's this? Costumes as well? A limited supply from the wardrobe store. Splendid. They're certainly getting their money's worth. Whatever next? Scenery? They're mostly imagined or representational, sir. Nonetheless, under the circumstances, good going. Thank you, sir. Despite the strong smell of mothballs. Anyway, onwards, Jeeves. What first occurred on this sunny morning in question? Sunny afternoon, sir. Already? 2.30 p.m. Splendid. First, I had to inform you that Miss Bing telephoned earlier, sir. What? Again? What did she want this time? She did not confide in me, sir. She merely laughed and hung up. Laughed? That does not bode well, Jeeves. Contrary to the old saying, when Stiffy laughs, the rest of the world usually fails to see the funny side. <laughs> what on earth was that, Jeeves? An approximation of a doorbell, sir. <laughs> oh, who is it? I believe at this point in the narrative, Mr. Fink Nottle called. Gussie? What did he want? I will admit him, sir. Oh, good idea. Apparently, at this point, enter Gussie. Recluse and passionate student of pond life, with particular regard to newts. Oh, uh, hello, Jeeves. Good afternoon, Mr. Finknottle. What ho, Gus? Good Lord. I thought it was him for a minute. Wonderful, Crunchy. Absolutely spot on. Oh, thanks. They're all rallying around, aren't they, Jeeves? Gratifying, isn't it? Indeed, sir. A friend in need is a friend in... Uh, Indeed, sir. Indeed he is. Oh. Crunchy Crabtree, everyone. Oh, uh, hello. Hello. Yes. Hello. It's an English tradition. We like to say hello. We hope by shaking hands that we'll recall your name. We work on that basis, remembering faces, but that's about all. 